Hello, my digital planner friends. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are gonna go over a plan with me. We're gonna do for the month of November, and of course, we're gonna do a Thanksgiving theme. This kit is part of my fall collection, and if you haven't seen that video, make sure you check that video out where I released five new kits for the month for fall. If this is something that you're interested in, make sure you hit that like button. If you're new here, my name is Brandy Reed, and I'm with Three Nail Faith, where I create digital planners and digital stickers for Christian women. Make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any videos that I create. Let's get to planning. Well, here we are back with a plan with me. So we're gonna do November of 2022. We are going to use um, a Thanksgiving kit. I already have all my meetings flagged and I'm using the color changing stickers um, because I just kind of transfer them from month to month and it's easier to do that. And I will show you how to use these color changing stickers in just a moment. And let's see, we're gonna go, this is the kit we're gonna use. We're using the Thanksgiving kit from Three Nail Faith. We have cute little, um, cute little scenes. We have a scripture and another background color, the same background, so if you wanna use those. Scripture, scripture, background, scripture, background. We have prayer list, to-do list, a little box, two washi, the flags. Like I was showing you a minute ago, we I was using the flags, but I didn't use these particular ones. I used, again, my color changing ones because I just transfer them to month to month. We have weekend. We have a checkbox um, flag. Today, a water, a track, habit tracker. And then we have our date covers. And then we have a couple of cute happy Thanksgiving, a pile of pumpkins birthday, family time, um, payday, Bible. This is like my planner that I use for, um, oops, planner, a church, a rainbow, coffee cup. Then we have payday, day off, and a blank. And we have all of these circles, your moods. Uh, we have all these little different um, like flag things. We have this where you can use these to track things like maybe your meals, um, just whatever you want to track. And then these over here, uh, you would copy this into your planner first and then copy this onto it again. So that way um, your layering works right. So always make sure you copy this in first to your planner and then whichever of these, because like you can just layer it on top of it. And then you can, you say, you know, you have Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and then you can write whatever. Um, and then these are your hex codes. I have them all loaded into my planner already, but I wanna show you how to do that real quick. Uh, you would hit your text button. You'll tap on that, hit edit. Oops, sometimes I don't get that right. Copy, go over to your pen tool, hit this one with the little down circle, go to custom, Draw a line through it, hit paste, and then hit your little plus button. And so now you can see I've got two of those, but those are my three colors. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and delete the last one because I don't need two of them. So you hit edit, you'll click that, you click the color you wanna get rid of and hit remove color. So now you have, we have our three colors. Now, because you can use this to, you, um, to style your planner, what you would do is you can either use your lasso tool, copy, and then come over to your planner, long hold, paste, and then resize it to whatever you want. You can do it that way. Or you can hit this little side button right here. It's like a rectangle with a line through it. And that'll open it in a new window and you can readjust and again, slide that down. So you can do that, make sure your lasso tool's on. You can uh, copy and hold and drag it over. And I made that too small, but resize. It, a, a good tip to know, it's gonna look really blurry when you first bring it in. I mean, that looks terrible, but as soon as you drop it, it looks fine. And we're gonna delete that. All right, so you can either do it, you, you will get the good notes 
if you purchase this set, you will get the Good Notes uh, version. You will also get the Elements Tool version that you can load in. And that has all of them this way. You can do the same thing with using your little, um, which we are going to use that, using that. And it'll open on the side window. I just like this, I guess, because it's smaller and I can have more space. I'm not sure. I just like it. Um, but you can use it this way or the other way. But I'm going to go ahead and get out of this because since adding the elements, I really have liked to use the elements. So again, I hit the elements tool. I hit that side button. I shrink it over and pinch with your two fingers to uh, change the size of your thing. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to get started by, I want to add a a top header and I think I'm going to use I really like these turkeys so you look let me show you how to do that again you long hold and drag now a lot of times these may come in wonky wonky is my word um, so what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to use the picture tap on the picture tap on that and then you can drag When you use this, it's going to, as you can see, it's adding to that side and that side at the same time. So I usually try to center it as best I can. Um, so that way it's easy to, cause I was wanting it between those two. Now I wanna make sure this is much smaller. I do love this guy, but I think, um, yeah, I'm not gonna use that here. Change of plans. Good thing about digital planning, you can easily change plans and it doesn't matter. You know what I should have done? Let's see, I'm gonna move this over here for right now because I didn't clean, I didn't fix these first. So you're gonna wanna go, if you use color changing stickers, you wanna go to your lasso tool Make sure your text boxes is turned off if you have writing on them. See how mine have writing on them? So I'm going to lasso and see how the writing went away. And that is because I'm just coloring in these uh, little flags. Tap it, hit color, and we're gonna go to our, our um, colors that match this set. So I'm gonna do yellow for the first one Let's see if we've, I think we've got, yeah. Color, let's do the orange. Color, brown. Yeah, that'll be all right. And color, we're gonna go back to the yellow again, I think. Yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna turn my, go back to my last one and make sure I turn text boxes back on in case I wanna move anything around. Like, I, added the Veterans Day in there so I wouldn't forget that we have Veterans Day. Um, why did that change? Don't know. Go back to the, that one. Okay, so we'll touch our, our picture again. We're gonna move this down here because I want that guy down there instead of on top. And I'm going to use, because he's just too cute to cover up with anything. And I wanna make sure that I add a, um, you know, a header to the month. Okay, so again, I'm trying to line it up in between there. I'm gonna shrink it down. And that's still, whoops, too big. Okay, so we added that in. So now I want, um, I think I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger. <clears throat> okay, now I'm gonna add, um, I want my noteworthy font. Put November. Now I can see it's way too small. So I'm gonna triple, one, two, three. If you triple tap it, it will highlight it all. And, oh. Let's see if we can make that a little bit bigger. That'll work. Okay. So we've got that. Now I want to go ahead and do 
my um, date covers. Sometimes they, for whatever reason, decide to move all over the place. I'm just kind of trying to put them in close to their spots. And then we'll go ahead and readjust them just so they're all in there for us. So we can zoom in easily. And that one keeps walking in. We'll fix it in a minute. All right, where's the rest of those date covers? There they are. Like I said, sometimes they go in weird spots. All right, now we're gonna zoom in. See how wonky those some of them turned out? We're gonna go to, again, our picture tool. Click on it. First thing we're gonna use is this little circle, straighten it out. Make it as close. I'm not one to be really crazy about how close it is. We're just having fun. Enjoying. believe it is already almost November. Where in the world has this year gone? Thanksgiving's right around the corner. Christmas is about here. Have you guys started shopping yet? Have you started your Christmas shopping yet? I am just about done. I have to shop early because I'm pretty busy in the month of October in November and December, so I try to get my shopping done as pretty early. Again, we're fixing these crazy wonkiness. Hmm, I don't think I added to this kit anything to cover up the little circles. I leave the circles on there in case um, you want to use them for the weekly view and you don't have um, anywhere to put your dates, you know, like you would put, you know, six there for the sixth. Um, let's see, what can I use? Ah, yes, we do. We will do this. We'll take that little turkey and we will go to the, um, picture tool again and tap it again. And we're going to hit crop, crop. And I'm gonna take out the Happy Thanksgiving and try to go as close to my little guy as I can. Then I'm gonna zoom him down so that he fits right there. I'm gonna move him back down because when you copy, you don't wanna copy on top of another sticker um, because it'll copy both of them. So we are copying. We're gonna move him back. Paste. There we go, we can use the little turkey guy over that. Just kind of hides it a little bit. You don't have to do this step, just one of those. I don't really like to see the little circles, but I know that some people need them for the weekly views or even the daily views if you want. Okay, so we got our little turkeys with all of that. Um, I'm gonna go in and do my weekend. Where's my weekend sticker? I probably passed it. Nope, there he is. Like most weekends, we just do the same thing. So I always just copy and paste everything. Weekends. All right, let's see. I plan on the weekends. Try to plan on Sunday what, what I want to get done. Um, we go to church. And we have family time it's Saturday. So I usually just, you know, copy and paste that all in. And if things change, I can always, that keeps flipping over on me today. I can always go in and change, update, whatever. But that's the general things that we do on the weekends. Um, let's see. We have, I have my coffee chat, and I love to add this little coffee cup. And again, we're going to size down and then copy and paste. Delete it. Okay. Copy. We'll move him down. Okay. 
We have Bible study on Wednesdays. Um, let's see, Thanksgiving is right there, so we'll just leave that as big as we can for that day. And I want to decorate I'm gonna put one of the Bible verses in that spot right there. Oh, we have Veterans Day too. We need to make sure we highlight that on that Friday. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and do that now. Let's add, I'm going to add this. All right, now, so we're doing some layering. So this is going to be a good example. Okay, see how it's not quite straight too? Go back to your image tool and you straightened it out. But do you notice our text is gone? So we're going to lasso on the corner because this guy, we're going to copy it, move that one over, paste, make it a little bigger, and now he's there. So that also means my kids have no school. Well, you know what, let's just do this. Oh, I want the text. Edit, and then I'm gonna hit return. You can either hit return there, or this little guy right here also does a return. No school. And that'll work. Let's go right here. And hit center. There we go. All right. So we got that in. The kids don't have school this entire week, which is actually the first time that's ever happened. They usually are only off Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, but this year they're off the whole week. So let's, you know what? Let's use our pen tool. We have all those colors. Let's use the orange and just going to draw a line, terrible line, I know, but we're going to hold it and it's going to straighten out for us. And you know what? Let's do, let's go make that line thicker. I want it to be a pretty thick line. There we go. So we now really can see it. And hmm, I just don't love that though. Let's do like that and then like that. That's better for me. And then we'll write no school. And highlight it and let's make that a little bigger so we can really see it. And do I want to leave it black or let's see what it looks like on the color, the, change it to the color, that goldy color. Mm, it's kind of hard to see. So let's go with the brown because I don't want it to be exactly the same as uh, the line. So now I'm going to copy that and put it over here, even though we know it's no school on Thanksgiving too. Um, what else? Uh, ha, ha, ha. Let's decorate. Oh, I wanted to put a Bible scripture in. I think they're all at the top. Um, let's put this one in here. Okay. So it's not going to fit, but I want it to really fit. So come over to the uh, image tool. I don't know why I can't seem to remember that word today. Slide your side, slide your upper, and now it fits. And let's see what else. I like this 
little guy. I'm going to put him right here. And obviously, if anything changes in, I can always move these stickers. If, I, if something ends up being on that Thursday, I can move that sticker if I want. What else do we have? Um, add her in. Just give thanks. But I don't want to cover the whole block. So let's... Hmm. Let's just do that. Because I don't really want to cover the whole block. I want to be able to see my date. And that one says Happy Thanksgiving. So I don't want to use that because I'm using that. And... Do I want to use one of these? I really love this guy. Let's move that in. Again, go to your image tool, whoops, image tool. It's not too big. And just fill in that shape, that shape. Hmm, maybe I don't really love that. What can I put there? You know what I forgot? I forgot payday. I had to add that in. Let's see. Payday goes there. And then it goes there. So let's get rid of this guy. Put the payday in. And then on the next day, we always pay the bills. So... We got yellow there, so let's add the brown. And then I'm gonna write pay, use that uh, down arrow, bills. And I'm gonna come up here, well first I'm gonna come up here and I am going to first off center it. And we need to shrink it. Then we want to, I want to put my lines a little bit closer together so it fits on there better. Then the last thing I want to do is I'm going to lasso it, color it, and I want to add that yellow. So I think, yep, that's going to make it pop. But I want to make it just a little bit smaller so it fits on there better. There we go. Now we're going to lasso both of them, copy, and put it up here. With that. All right. What else? What else? So I don't love that little spot. I just like dressing things up a little bit. I like everything to have something on it. It may just be, hey, you know what? Let's just put him in again because it's just, I just love this thing. This little, um, there you go. That works. Let's make it a little bigger. Just out of curiosity, what's that going to look like there? Probably not so good because of the the date but we want to make sure the date is available because that's actually a link to the daily page um let's see yeah i think well i don't know let's see let's see how that looks no i think i'm gonna go even though i really like that i may use that I may just use that on a on a week page or a daily page or something. Oops, I think I bumped the camera. And so I think that looks good. Let's see, we don't we've got our coffee chat, our Bible, study, our church, planner, family time, bills, decorated a little bit in there. I think. That is good for the month. Oh, I wonder. I just really love these guys. I wonder if that would look cute. Copy. 
playlist. We'll see. I'll leave it for now. So I'll definitely be using, you know, um, the rest of these scriptures and the prayer things, um, all these different things in my weekly ones. Um, if you'd like to me to start making weekly plan with me, let me know uh, instead of just the day or the monthly ones. And yeah, I mean, you can use any of these stickers when you get gas, all these different things. And as the month goes on, I'll probably add things to it as well. But those are just some of the main things that I needed and wanted to add. And so, yeah. So if you have any questions, uh, leave a comment below. If you're not sure how I did something or want to just want me to, to explain something, anything else, or if you have any ideas, again, if you would like to see weekly plan with me's as well as the monthlies, let me know that. And go ahead and like this video if you liked this video and go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss anything that I put out. We will talk to you to the next time and you have a wonderfully blessed day. Bye-bye.